It all began in 1967. Bill Robinson was a sophomore in high school when he got a job at IGA Hickman's as a bag boy. I made a dollar ten an hour. A lot has changed since his first years on the job. Minimum wage now is up to 7.35. From bag boy to store manager. The whole time it's always been with IGA. More than four decades. If I don't know him by name, uh, I know him definitely by face. At the same store. That's 45 years, 46. Yeah, it's a long time. He made the decision to retire about six months ago. I want to spend time with my grandchildren. His time with IGA will come to a close this Saturday. It will be a bittersweet moment for Robinson and many of his 32 employees. He's pretty special to each one of us. If we ever have any problems, he's there to help us through it. He's been a great boss, and it's kind of like a dad, kind of losing your dad. But uh, it's going to be hard on us, but uh, it'll be good. It'll be fine. I hope he has a great retirement and comes by and see us every once in a while. <laughs> if you ask Robinson what he enjoyed most, he'll tell you it's been the younger generations of workers he's hired over the years. The stories they tell and the things they do. I guess kind of keeps you, keeps you upbeat a little bit on it. Robinson continues to stay upbeat with yet another change. IGA will pass the torch to a new set of owners, the Neemans, who plan to take over the store on April 4th. It'll bring strength to the area. I really feel that way. The signs will read County Market, but staff here are hopeful not too much else will change. Brooke Hash, KHQA News, Bowling Green, Missouri.